Hello crafty friends! My name's Alicia, but you can call me Crafty Owl. And it is time to debut the brand new sheet load of cards for November 2024. If you're new to my channel or to sheet load of cards, this is a free printable that I share each month here on my channel where I give you a new sketch, supply list, and cutting guides to make the most of your products and yield a sheet load of cards. This is usually anywhere between 6 and 12 cards depending on the sketch and the paper size that we're using. Today on the first, I'm going to share a look at the new printable the first set I made, and then tell you how you can download the printable for free if you're a subscriber to my channel. Tomorrow I'll be back to share the process with you and give you some tips along the way, and my creative team will be joining me with their takes on the newest sheet load. You can find their channel links down in that description box below. If you don't already subscribe to them, I would recommend doing that so you're all ready to go for tomorrow. Also joining us tomorrow on the 2nd is our November 2024 guest artist. Let's go ahead and learn about her. As I was searching YouTube earlier this year for possible creators to bring on as guest artists, I ran into the Beck and Sam Crafting Fun channel. So I reached out to Beck Ann, who is the creator behind the channel, and was thrilled when she agreed to join us for the November 2024 sheet load of cards. She shares on other social media as well, so make sure if you don't already subscribe to her here on YouTube and follow her elsewhere that you go do that. I have clickable links down in that description box below. Now let's do a little Q&A with Beck Ann. Before I share a look at the new printable, I want to take a couple minutes to recognize some special channel members. In the month of October, I had some members earn their two-year membership badge. Congratulations to Robin P. Deborah Cable. Jay Thomas. Pam. And Kathy Capron, thank you so much for your continued support. Also in October, I had some members earn their three-year membership badge. Congratulations goes to Kay Smith, Carmen Broxma, Marla Kimmel, Doreen Wolf. Vicki Emerson, Dimples Williamson, and Pam Kolstad. Thank you so much for your continued support of my channel. If you would like to find out more about the perks of channel membership, you can click on the join button below this video or click on the link down in that description box. Now let's take a look at the November 2024 sheet load of cards. If you follow the sketch, supply list, and cutting guides for November 2024, you're going to yield 8 A2 cards using just 2 pieces of pattern paper and some cardstock. As always, if you don't want to make a full sheet load, maybe you have some scraps to use up or you just want to give the sketch a try, I do provide the dimensions for each piece here on page one, as well as some ideas how to do alternatives or make the sketch your own. Maybe you'll rotate, pop pieces up, change the position of pieces. As always, sheet load is a great jumping off point for you to make the card your own. On page two, I'm going to show you how to cut the pattern papers and the card stocks, and I'll also do that in tomorrow's process video. So make sure to click on that subscribe button and stop back by if you haven't already. 
after you've made a sheet load this month, I would love to see it. So make sure if you share on social media that you use the hashtags at the top. And I also have a video linked below with the updated guidelines on how to show us your sheet load, whether it's online or sending in a card for the end of the month video. I always love to see what you create. Before we take a look at my first set for the month, I want to tell you about the main products you'll see me use in tomorrow's video. A couple weeks ago, I visited my local scrapbook and stamp store, Scrapbook Haven, here in Omaha, and I met up with a couple crafty friends. Up on screen now is a picture of us after we had checked out with all of our goodies. That is Sarah Liz of Sassy's LLC, Danny of Danny's Dreams, and I. If you live in the area or are passing through, make sure to check out the store. They carry lots of fun products, cute products, including the papers in front of me. I decided for November 2024, I wanted to go with a fall theme. So I am using today two pieces from Cartabella's Harvest Collection. These pumpkins, which I am loving kind of this dark mint green one, and then just a more subtle pattern to go with it. For my sentiments this month, this is actually a free printable I will be telling you more about tomorrow that's for channel members. Now the file is black and white, but I do have some options to color it. So what I did is I tried to color match that dark mint pumpkin for my text. And for matting, I will be using this dark orange. This is pumpkin cardstock from Tailored Expressions. Since the background of this pattern paper is kind of off-white, I did go with that cardstock for my sentiments, and I'll be using the same color for my card bases. Tomorrow, of course, I'll tell you about other products and tools I use, but you can always leave a question there if you have any. So now, let's go ahead and take a look at my first set of cards. I hope you enjoyed getting that peek at the first set of cards I made using the November 2024 sheet load of cards. If you did, as always, a thumbs up is appreciated. Now let me tell you how you can download the free printable. If you would like to make a set of cards using the newest printable, as always, I do ask that you're subscribed to my channel before you click on the link, which I'll tell you where it's at here in just a minute. Subscribing is free, quick, and easy. Just click on the button right below this video, and while you're there, why don't you click the bell and turn on all notifications so you know when I've uploaded my latest videos. You're gonna find the link to the November 2024 sheet load of cards down in the description box right below the related products list. Below that, it will say to watch the video for a password, and you watching this far is the password. You can download it to your device and then print it, or you can download it and just use it on screen. That is up to you. Also, while I have printed mine in color, you can also print it on a black and white printer and it will work just as well. Don't forget to stop back by tomorrow to see how I made my cards and see the creative team sets. And until then, I hope you're all having a crafty day. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch all the way to the end of the video. I hope now you'll consider clicking on one of the videos or playlists I have linked above. And if you are interested in any of the products or tools I used in today's video, I do have some links in the description box below.